what is up everybody the hunter gt with the hunter gt.com that's right go check out the website what is going on today we are at the courthouse park right here that's right this is the courthouse now i want to say they built this back in the 60s or so and tore down the other courthouse that was sitting uh, just about there or a little bit forward of it right up in here but it was from like 1910, 1920, something crazy, like almost turn of the century, basically. It was an old style courthouse. I'll throw up a picture of it if I remember here. But yeah, multiple wheat pennies, multiple silvers, rosies, mercury dimes found up in here in this area. It goes way back over there, off into the distance. So it's a pretty big little courthouse park, ton of homeless people here, just like the other park I hunt. So it gets a little shady every once in a while, but the sheriff's office is right on the other side. See that far back building there, direct center? That's the sheriff's office. So there's always sheriffs walking around through here. They don't care that we hunt here. They just kind of wave and stop, ask us if we found anything cool, stuff like that. XP Orcs, the detector of the day. Want to pick one of these bad boys up? Who are you going to contact me? Of course, the hunter GT at gmail.com is my email address. I would love and appreciate your business. The Deus 2 is on the way. I thought I'd have it by now, you know, it's already like January 1st, 2nd now when I'm when you're gonna see this video So I thought I'd have it in my hands, but not yet. It's on the way review video of that coming up with multiple Hunt videos and I got to review this the XP Yorks as well. I've been meaning to review this I've already shot most of the video. I just need to edit it great detector lightweight super fun to use great relic hunter great coin shooter, too I'm liking it. So I'm using it today to get myself excited and used to it for the day is two. That's right. So without further ado, why don't you shut your face, the Hunter GT. Let's go find us some courthouse finds. All right, you're not gonna be able to hear the tones really today. Um, I got headphones on, there are people here. I don't wanna piss them off or anything. I don't know if you're gonna be able to hear that coming through my headphones, but no speaker today. 91, 92 there. 91 right there so it should be a dime penny hopefully a wheat i doubt it though it's really shallow so we'll find out what it is there it is a clad dime just like it said it was I mean, we got a visitor here Are you guys ready for this huh look at this guy i think he wants some snackage something like that huh yeah people feed you that's for sure you don't come this close to humans unless someone's feeding you nuts and seeds and whatever else squirrels eat. Yeah, he came right up pretty close here, so I think the people over here sitting on the benches and stuff. It's a nice park. You get a lot of people here that just sit on the benches and stuff. A lot of homeless. Um, unfortunate that their situation makes them that way. But uh, you get a lot of people just sitting here enjoying the view. It is a nice park with some friendly squirrels. On to the next surface find basically it was like it's dirty like it's been dug but it wasn't it was just sitting on the surface right there but i had to rub the date it's got so much crud on it 1964 so we're in silver range if that was a dime it would be silver right there baby that's a good sign that's a good sign i've hit like three 1978s and like three 1976s off camera so kiss it, 1977, you stupid piece of... Oh, my God, these guys are just... Look at this guy. He wants some. Look, he's got buddies over here. Man, you guys, you're right up on me. I mean, that's my knee right there. Don't bite me. I don't want rabies. Whatever you guys got. Look at this guy over here. I mean, I got like five of them around me right now. They're all begging. Look at this guy right here. Oh, he's sniffing the quail. He, hey, don't you take a bite of my quail. You're sitting on my detector, boy. What are you doing? Look at this dude. Yeah, there's some friendly squirrels at this park. That's for sure. Uh -oh, we got a... 93. 94, 93, that's silver range. Oh, and 91, that's dime penny range. We don't want that. Clad dime, I have no idea why it was reading up like 93, 94. Usually these are 91 on the dot, especially shallow. I mean, it was two inches deep. No idea why it was ringing up so high. Nothing else in the hole. I don't know, maybe it's, maybe this is a missed strike and it's really silver. No, see the copper band on the side there. 
So, oh well. Strange one. A strange one. 1965. Come on, man. One year off. Only one year off. Not very deep, as you can see. Like, maybe an inch down, two inches down. Everything here has been pretty shallow so far. Everything I found here, all the wheat pennies, mercs, rosies here, just like the old park that I dig, are all usually two, one, two, three inches down. A lot of this stuff. And then you find a zinc penny at like 15 inches. It makes zero sense. Ninety, ninety-three, ninety-four, ninety-two. Silver range clad is usually a dime penny is usually 91, 92. So this one's 94, 93. But a lot of clad I've dug today has been off ID. I don't know if it's a rain or mineralization or what. Hoping this is silver. Hoping it's not a clad dime or penny, but we shall see. 1978 freaking penny are you kidding me i don't understand why that's ringing up so high being a mere three inches down i mean that should be a 91 dead on it's going to be 91 if i just pop it on the surface but it's a 94 <laughs> a mere three inches down that's what these california minerals do right there in that little plug spot i just found that i think it's part of a broken off ring or something I don't know it's like actually it's like a hexagon actually now that I look at it so I don't think that is a ring I don't know what it is but it's got like a cross on the top of it I thought it was like maybe some religious pendant or ring I don't know what it is I don't know if it's religious or a utility thing of some sort and there was something else that broke off there what do you think guys a religious pendant or something totally different a Phillips a large Phillips screwdriver wrench type thing or something I don't know I don't know what the heck man who knows on to the next just found that pretty deep like eight inches deep an old lock it's all broken up maybe it was the old jail key to the old courthouse or something like that I don't know it's an old lock for sure I'm assuming they don't make them in that shape, rounded like that, with a small hole on the back of it. I don't know what's going on with the IDs, but every silver range target is ending up being clad. I don't know. The rain and mineralization here is doing something. Oh, 1977. Get the heck out of my face. Just found that, doodad. I don't know what it is. Some sort of, like, plate or something. I don't know. Looks like it's cut here and there. It might just be a scrap piece of copper. I don't know if there's writing on this side. This side's real crusty. I don't know what it could be. No hole in it. Nothing like that. Who knows? Piece of junk. Dude, like what in the HE double hockey sticks? This ring up as a 94, okay? Quarters ring up as a 95. Dimes, pennies ring up as a 91. This was about six, seven inches deep. And it is up averaging that much? This is the bonkers day. I don't understand this. I've hunted this courthouse like four or five times, found multiple wheat pennies, multiple silvers here. I've never seen the mineralization cause this. It's, it has to do with the rain, mineralization, something like that combination it's been raining like crazy here in california just drenched lately the lakes are full all the reservoirs are full all of the uh, water holding fields you know those big pits i can't remember what they call them but uh yeah big fields that they dig pits out for water to sit yeah those are all full lately ah oh, this is crazy i can't believe i haven't found a silver based on the ids i know you don't dig coins on ids alone but uh, come on now All right, we got a 95. I don't know if that's coming in for you guys over the headphones. Sorry, there's so many people here. I don't want to ruin their day at the park. 94, 95, it should be a quarter. But knowing today, it could be a zinc penny. Everything's ringing up so high. I don't know why. I don't know why I swallowed a fly. 
Well, there it is, a state's quarter. Very well may be the first correct ID that we've had on the video today. I'm not sure. Man, it is a crazy day as far as IDs. And yes, I know, this is why you don't go off ID alone, Hunter GT. Oh, this is why I put the remote in my pocket and dig tones only. This is why, this is why, this is why I do, I do, I do. Shut your faces. This is the way I do it. Oh boy, a 66. Come on, man, two years off. Two years off. I can't believe I haven't dug a wheat penny or a silver today. I have dug more clad than I ever have before at this courthouse park. I mean, I've probably got 50 coins in my pocket and I've had like a four or five wheat penny day here before. I've had a multiple silver day here before, I wanna say. This is bonkers. I can't believe I haven't dug something old yet. It's craziness other than the lock. I guess the lock was pretty old, right? That counts. Surface find. Look at that. Wish it had a couple zeros after it and the rest of it included. Well, there it is, a $1 corner right there just laying on the surface. Somebody was holding it. They were like, I'm getting ready to get on the bus over here and somebody snatched it and that's all they held on to was the corner. That's the story and I'm sticking to it. Well guys, I think I'm calling it a video. Look at all that clad that I dug. There's gotta be 40, 50 coins right there. I've already dropped a couple. There's a couple down there that I've dropped while I tried to get my phone out and everything. I had them all in my hand. Yeah, not a single wheat penny, not a single silver. I have never been skunked here at this courthouse. I've, I've come out with multiple wheat pennies usually and at least a silver, but nothing today, man. I mean, it kicked my butt. I got up and down so many times. I feel like the squat master. Uh, there's the courthouse. I still wish the, the old one was up. It was great looking, man. It was fantastic looking. But such is life. All right, guys. Hope you enjoy these videos. Clad is rad only on this one. Sorry about that. What can you do? The Hunter GT signing off. I will see you on the next video.